Well, those three deer are looking at us. And we're looking at them. Like this. It's a beautiful day. 50 degrees and we're almost in January. 50 degrees in December. Can't argue with that. Anyway, sorry. Uh, today is the um, Feast of the Holy Family. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Isn't that something people say? Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. I think it's not a... Anyway, um, when they're surprised. Or used to say, nobody says that now. So today is the, is the feast, the first... Uh, I'm going to, might go into this de later because um, it's such beautiful uh, Bible passages. It, uh, I was reading, it says they don't, ne they never do a second reading on this day. It's uh, this, there's different options, Colossians, but what was chosen was Sirach chapter three. And it talks about um, honoring that you should honor your father and your mother, basically. But uh, I, it's so beautiful, I may read it later to you. So watch for that. Um, and then the gospel is when Joseph is uh, told in a dream to rise and take the child and his mother uh, and go to Egypt because Herod is going to go after the child. And we heard two days ago, I think, about oh, the deer going. We heard about um, the uh, mar martyr of the innocents and how Herod was so uh, evil that he had all the children under two years old killed. Males, firstborn males. And so um, today we hear that uh, Joseph is told by an angel, they were in a dream to rise and take the child, and he does. And uh, also, what else is on my mind? What else is on my mind is I may have to finally, we got the van, I often say, we got the van when we got the boy. So we got the 2000 Dodge Caravan when we had the first baby boy, who's now obviously nearly 20, no, he's obviously, it's almost, 23, but he's actually already 23 years old. And I got the got the report that two cylinders are bad. Six cylinder engine is now running on four, and he says it could break a rod or something. I forget what he said. That the engine could blow. I said, well, will it literally blow up? He said, I don't know. I never had anybody drive a car after that, so I'm going to keep driving it just to find out. Um, but anyway, I'm a little dis distressed because I, I've nursed that car for probably the last four years. It probably should have been put to rest. It's rusting and underneath. I mean, you can't see it, but it doesn't stop me from going to the grocery store or going to church with it. The bit, little bit, the bit of rust underneath. But it's really not worth putting money into. So I may have to put the van put the family van that's literally been with us for the entire childhood of our children from birth when I anyway I'll talk about that later what else and I may also talk to you about uh, the song American Girl so watch for that uh, that'll be special that song just came Tom Petty who passed uh, 2017 the, passed a few years ago, a little way early than he should have, but um, so I'm going to talk about that, and Gus is going to, whoa, 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 don't splash me, Gus is going to sit here and sit on his, you know, that water's got to be cold, so anyway, today is the feast of the uh, Holy Family, and 
this is the Dog Walk Chronicles. And as it's winter, I may get a little more. Yeah, good luck with that. That thing, that piece of ice probably weighs 20 pounds. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that probably weighs 30 or 40 pounds, guys. You're not going to pick that up with one mouth. And I'm not going to pick it up with two fingers. He does love him some water. So if at first you don't succeed, try again. He'll try to pull it out. Wow. Gus is the ice killer. Destroyer of ice. Destroyer of all things ice. Okay, guys. Sit. 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 Good gosh, you embarrassing dog. Sit. Hey. Sit. Sit. Good boy.